to make there's a lot going on a lot of videos coming down the pipeline I'm extremely busy right now as you all know I recently successfully finished my comprehensive exam as part of my comprehensive exam requirements my committee thought it would be a good idea for me to do two syllabi one for an undergrad kind of a survey course with 100 students or more, and the second would be a smaller graduate seminar. I was really excited to do that because I've never completely designed a syllabus from beginning to end on my own. So I thought this will be really cool, it's great practice. Again, if you wanna go into academia or academe or however you pronounce it, I guess both words work. Teaching and research are the two primary things that you're required to do. And writing. Writing is actually the most important thing. That's what I would argue, but that, that's, that's a separate video. So in any case, I thought it would be a good idea for me to do these. And then I sat down and I actually began to try to do them. And I was astounded at how much difficulty I actually had in creating syllabi. You wouldn't think that it would be that hard. You would think, ah, not that big of a deal. You just come up with a few books, find a few articles. No, 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 no. If it's something that you're really taking seriously and that you want to create a journey for the students, you have specific goals that you want them to hit, theoretical concepts, analytical frameworks, all that kind of stuff. It's a lot more work than just <laughs> writing down a bunch of books and articles and assignments. So it took me a few more hours than I thought it would, but I'm super happy that I did it because now I've done it and I have confidence that I can do it again. So that's another thing. When you do something that you haven't done before, you gain that skill. And that's how I began to see everything that I've been doing in academia as opposed to being afraid of failure. It's I'm going to do it, I'm going to complete it, and there's no failure um, because you gain something from it, truly, I, I mean that. So anyway, a lot more videos coming up for you guys. As I have uh, alluded in prior um, vlogs, I'm going to be doing my dissertation research abroad, specifically I'm going to France for my dissertation research. I'm super stoked because I recently found out I won this fellowship that will basically pay for the entire time that I'll be in France to do my research. So that's great because it means that I have six years to finish my PhD instead of five. Uh, and that's awesome. Oh yeah, it's also St. Patrick's Day, which I forgot. So it's like... It's like college party day, basically. Which, when you're my age, you don't care about anything. So, <laughs> so yeah, anyway, I won this fellowship. 
More about that later. I'm going to a conference for graduate students of color. That's coming up. That's going to be great. My hands are getting kind of cold. Now, I'm not headed to a St. Patrick's Day party, although I am wearing my green, I guess. I'm headed to the camera screening scholarship media festival. It's an annual festival led by camera which is a multi-modal research collective here at Penn and it's documentaries and films created sometimes by students sometimes by professors but it pushes the boundaries and challenges the way that we understand and conceptualize academic research so I go every year friends of mine are actually on the planning committee so I'm heading to that and it should be fun. There's lots of really cool um, videos every year. They always do workshops, and there's always free food, and we love free food, don't we? So, yes, I'm really excited. Even though it's a gloomy day, I'm just, I'm in a great mood. Oh yeah, and I have to go print out a bunch of forms. So yeah. All right, this is five minutes of me talking. I think that's quite enough. So I will catch you later. Hey, Leah. Hi. Oh my gosh, I finally got the amazing Leah Barlow. Whatever. On my vlog, she's oh incredible. Y'all, if y'all think Leah is cool on the vlog, you should meet her in person. She is cool as a cucumber. <laughs> she's brilliant. So and beautiful. Because no. she is brilliant and beautiful and not cool as a cucumber, actually the exact opposite. <laughs> Super hype, but you need that on this here channel and in graduate school. <laughs> Yeah. So we're both at the same um, media festival. Are you yeah. vlogging this girl? It's going to be on your channel. I am. No, I'm not going to vlog this. She's not going to vlog this. But yeah, so we just wanted to say hello because we need to vlog together, but we are going to do a video together eventually. Yeah, we I am. I have to do a video with my idol. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Until I find the lady, only words I know that you. Until I, until I, until I.